Hey guys, it's Chris Boy with Tag Muay Thai. Today I'm going to show you a self-defense technique for the headlock. So I have my partner right over here. He's going to go ahead and grab me in that headlock. Okay, the first thing I want to do is I want to make sure that I'm, I'm very stable. At the same time, you're going to see that with this opposite hand right here, I'm going to go ahead and grab onto his hips. From this point, I'm basically trying to pull. I'm basically pulling his uh, wrist. From this point, my head is turning into him. So if he's basically squeezing a little bit tighter, okay, I'm basically pulling. And all I'm going to do is that this hand, I'm just going to push on his lower back. So I'm basically going to transition and at the same time I'm pulling and I can go ahead and escape. When I say that I escape, once I pull my head away, he's going to turn into me. This is when I go ahead and put up on my barriers. Okay. Another option is, is that when he basically locks it, okay, I'm pulling into him and depending on my footwork, I'm thinking about using this knee bump. So I'm taking my knee and I'm not lifting my leg up and to kind of swing and knock him over. What I'm doing is I'm basically just kind of just, you can just see that I'm just turning my foot. I'm basically pivoting my foot or I'm just basically striking with that knee. When I'm doing that, because I have control of his hips, what I'm gonna do is once I knock it straight down to the ground, I pull him straight down to the ground. From this point, I can hit him, whatever I need to do. If he tries to recover, this is when I can go ahead and boot with any type of kick. And do you really need to be a trained fighter to throw a kick to the face? No, you just basically have that bad bone in your body with bad intentions and you just swing your leg as hard as you can. Um, so those are the two different options for that um, headlock. Thanks for watching.